In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to import data from a text file into MATLAB, and also how to represent 4D data by using scatter and color bar commands. Let's start with importing the data from a text file. Make sure that you are selecting the Home tab. Now you can select Import Data. I will choose the file I've already created. Now the import window will appear with all the details of your file data. You can double check the data and even select specific data to be imported. After making sure that everything is OK, click Import Selection. It will take some time to load the data. Here you can see that I have imported four columns of data. Each column contains 5301 value. On the right window you can see that MATLAB has created four different variables, each variable contains a data set from my text file. If you double click any of the variables, you can check the different values inside this variable. Now I will copy paste the code I will use for plotting the 4D data and I will explain it line by line. In the first line you can see that I'm using scatter3 command, to plot 3D data as points. In the scatter3 command I can assign the different variables to x, y and z axis. You can see that I have assigned the x axis to load data set, y axis to con data set and finally z axis to kilo watt data set. I have also typed comma 40, comma evap. This is my fourth set of data. It's nothing but a certain range of temperature between 1 and 5. So basically the points on my plot will have a color based on the EVA value. For example if the EVAP value is 3, the point color will be blue. When it's 5, the point color will be dark red. The next three commands are related to setting labels to X, Y and Z axis. To initiate the color bar in my 3D plot, I have typed CB equals color bar. And finally, the last command is to give a label to the color bar, which in my case the evap leaving temperature. To execute the code, I will hit enter. As you can see I have a 3D plot based on the first three data set, load cond and kilowatt. And the color bar is used to change the color of the plotted points based on the fourth data set values.